Alrighty, so I believe I am all ready. All I need to do is, where is it? Here's the key. All we need is the key and maybe wait for my food to run out. But other than that, I should be ready to go into the forest or into the, the where is it? The swamp. We're going to go into the swamp is what I'm saying. And the swamp should be just up ahead. So we got all the platters and I got all the potions. So I need to make sure I have those ones right. So... Hopefully I only need the potions if I really need them. Plus I got the poison resistant potion. Hello my good fellers! There we go. I also changed to the bronze buckler and the mace because apparently they do good against undead things. Let's go ahead and eat you. Hello my good fellows. My disgusting undead friends. There we go. Good stagger is what the buckler has. There's just a skeleton. What are you gonna do? There we go. There we go. Don't wanna get bit. There we go. Ah. Uh, actually, I completely forgot that I should probably have slept. Oh well, I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Maybe I should have worried about it. Hopefully I'll find a cave or something. That is a lot of leeches. I'll just give it a second and sprint. Ah, uh, you missed, foolish critters. So I have a ton of arrows too, so we are not going to be needing arrows. We have like two, uh, 300 arrows. So in case something really bad happens. Ow! I just get, oh, I forgot my stupid shield. How do I manage that? Alright, so... This is where the potion's gonna come in handy. There we go. So these guys should be able to hurt me now. At least for the most part. Who's shooting me? Where are you? There you are. Now you're in the water. I don't want to get bit by the leech. So that means I'm going to ignore you. And we have apparently have nine minutes of the potion. So that should be... Plenty, and plus I got like a ton of other potions, about nine more potions. And then also we have the stamina potion, minor stamina, just in case of emergencies. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, minor healing. So there we go. I think those also have a cooldown. Yeah, one minute cooldown. I probably didn't need to take in that case. Does it last for one minute? I don't think, no, it doesn't last for one minute. That would have been too good. So I believe we are looking for the sunken chambers, and you need the key, and the key's the only way to gain access to it, apparently. So I need to find that. I did do a little bit of exploring. I did not find any chambers, though, so I really gotta, oh, look for it. And uh, there's that thing. Um, what is this? Uh, ab it's an abomination. Lovely! Oh, and it's moving. What can you do? Eh, it's not the prettiest thing. Oh, dear. I don't think I want to get hit by that. Do you have to? I have what I need to beat you up. It is kind of cool, though. No, this game just reminds me of Dark Souls. I've not played Dark Souls, but stuff like that just seem very Dark Souls-y. I wonder, can I just, like, hide from it? What are you doing? Too hard. Where are you going? I don't think it can get me. Some flaming arrows would have been nice, but I don't think flames work in constant rain weather. And that is literally doing nothing to it. Maybe I should try and focus on getting the iron. I think it's iron that you need from the burial chamber. So I'm going to ignore that lovely feller there for a moment, and I'm going to simply run away. Because I don't want to deal with that. Hello, slime. I don't know what slimes do. I think they give you, like, explosives. Is what they give you. 
Is that guy coming for me? Uh, no, he's not. I don't think he is, at least. All right, zombies. What do we got over here? I think I've already been here. Yeah, there's normally spawners all over the place. Hello! Oh, there's iron arrows. I'll definitely take those. Die. Club. Oh, yeah, I forgot. The, the mace is apparently classed as club type. Yeah, I forgot about that. That weapons actually have, like, a rock, paper, scissors sort of effect, or, like, elements. Fire is good against uh, ice and that sort of stuff, whereas blunt stuff is good against solid objects or whatever. Whatever that stuff is. What do we got here? Pain, apparently. This looks like the edge. Oh, hello. This looks like the edge of the swamp. Lock you. So, I'm probably going to... Is this a really small swamp? Please don't tell me this is just a small swamp. That'd be really annoying if it was. Oh, my Ike Theory is nearly uh, all the way loaded back up. Hello. Go ahead and deal with you. And goodbye. It looks like it continues that way. I think that might be another dark forest over there. Or is that just the same way I came? No, it's a different area. What are you guys doing? I think one of them has a bow. If we shoot you... Oh. Yeah, one of them does have a bow. Go ahead and take you out, and then pretend like the other guy doesn't exist. There we go. I wish those guys dropped like iron arrows. That would have been some incentive to go for those guys. But no, they're just annoying. Ow. There we go. Oh! Stupid leech. Oh, what is this? Is it burial chambers? It looks like it. Goodbye. Alright, what are you gonna do? Take you out! Ah! What is this? Go ahead and take you out as quickly as possible. Alright, and we're going to take that. There we go. I think, um, what was it? This one also does really fast uh, regeneration. It slows your health down, though. And this was not a burial chamber. That's unfortunate. I think this is... Is this just... No, this, that's just another stupid dark forest. That's annoying. This is just some really tiny swamp. Ah! There we go. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be like buildings. Or some sort of constructs. It suddenly got really dark here. Is this more swamp? This might be more swamp. Some light, maybe? I don't think light's gonna help me. Especially when I can't see five feet in front of me. What is that? Uh, it's just more rock. Mushrooms. That's the first time I've seen any form of edibleness stuff. That's another... Say rock. What do you gotta say? What does the Say rock say? Uh, long ago, Odin's eye was turned from Valheim, yet while the gods ignored it, other creatures crept or fell through cracks into the forgotten world. Trolls, goblins... And men found their way along these secret paths. Kingdoms rose and fell, and are buried beneath deeps the ground. Walk among the dead, you owe, you tread a grave with every step. Lovely. Can I stop holding the lamp? Apparently not. There we go. Got some light here. Uh, yeah, this is pretty much the swamp. Well, that's kind of annoying. Got all this prep time, and I find out that there's literally nothing here. Great. There is another swamp. There is one, like, right across, like, down, down there, I think. Also, maybe along that way. What's it? What's that way? That's back, actually. Great. Well, I'm gonna run to the other swamp, and hopefully we can find a burial chamber. Well... I am struggling to find any swamp. I went to the other side of the map, and there's 
it's it's not even a swamp. It's a disgrace of a swamp. So, I don't know what better to do. So we're gonna fight this thing. Hello, abomination. I do try and defeat this guy. That is gonna be the objective for now, just to see what he drops. To see what happens when he hits me. What are you gonna do, huh? Oh, he's staggerable. Ow. Eh, it doesn't do too much damage. There we go. Ow. Ow. Alright, we're gonna back off here for a second. Just for a little bit. Oh, that did some good damage, actually. Uh. Get on the tree. Let's go ahead and take that potion. Give us some reach in. Gonna shoot you from a distance for a little bit. Alright, let's go ahead and try... Uh, maybe not. Alright, yeah, we'll do it. Come on. Ow! I keep... I can't time it right. Oh! Alright, we're gonna hide for a second. No, don't push me off. He pushed me off. Oh. I can have my potion. I think I'm gonna wait a second, though. Ow! Maybe a second will be too late. Where is he? He's right there. Right, he's going there. Oh, hello, Draugr. Hey, you can't get me from here. There we go. Where are you going? Alright, he's coming around the corner. Do some damage to him. Let's go ahead and try and jumping onto him. Oh, he does a poison attack. Deary me, no. Run! Ow! You running away from the abomination as well? Yeah, there's like three joggers over here. Alright, there. Here they come. There we go. Alright, this guy also. Alright, bring it on. And I'm stuck in the water. And there's another Draugr. And the Abomination here. Ow. Alright, no, no, no. Alright, any stamina? I put that stuff away. There we go. What is he doing? Is he attacking the little house? Come here. If I could give him to Stagger, that was doing some pretty good damage. I just can't see him when he staggers. Maybe this will help. Ow. That what didn't even hit me. There we go. Ow. Ow. There we go. Oh, he's knocking trees down. I wasn't paying attention. Got health back. There we go. Great. Back off here for a second. Oh. What are you doing? Oh, he's almost dead, actually. There we go. Ah! What do we get? Ooh, new stuff. 
So, there is another forest over here that might have another swamp at some point of it. Right now, I think I'm going to head back to base and see if I can't craft anything with this new stuff. And then after that, I'm going to explore this forest and hopefully find a swamp or a sunken chamber in this swamp. Until then, I'm probably just going to be wandering. And then also, I'm going to see what uh, I can make with this new root stuff. Go away. So I think the root outfit is like an archery setup, so... Plus you need 10 for each piece of armor, and then there's also the whole upgrading process you can go through, but I do not have enough of those roots right now, so I need like 10 of them for each one. So that will be quite a lot of uh, ancient root things I have to go and kill. Right now I'm going to try and see if I can't find any of the stupid burial chambers, because I am currently having some trouble with that, so... I'm going to be trying to do that for now. Well, I was doing some exploring, and apparently this is the plains, and there's a fulling. Whatever fulling is, he's tough. Get back here. I'm guessing I'm not going to get him. Ow. Ow. Go for the skeleton. Alright, let's grab a potion. Ow, okay, he hurts. No. Uh, yeah, I don't belong here. No, at least not at this point. Oh, my word, what is this place? Stump. Ow. What have I got myself into? Why is there a... Bug. Yeah, I um uh, uh Well First in the plains, I guess. I guess I don't belong there. Uh still no swamp though, so I'm gonna have to do some more looking around. Found what I was looking for finally. I found a new swamp and I found the what is it called? The sunken burial chamber. There's like one right here in this right area, and it was all the way over. So here's the base, home base, and then here's this place. Um, I built a little swamp teleporter outside the swamp, and then, yeah, the thing's like right here. Built a little base on top of it also, just in case. Uh, I can't set my spawn though. Oh, wait, I can set my spawn. Oh, uh, that's perfect. That's even better. Um, I just don't think I can leave at the moment because I need the teleporter to get out, but, uh, oh well. Might have to move the teleporter, maybe not, but right now, let's go ahead and open this thing, shall we? Swamp key used, did that, okay, it's permanent, nice. Alrighty, let's see, everything's set, got my weapons, I have my potions already activated. Doing good on food, let's go ahead and do this, sunken crypt. What do we get? I have not been in any of these, so there's water, so I'm gonna have a constant debuff with the water effect. It's a cool little place, though. So I think, for now, or if I need to, this ledge does work as like a border where they can't get me. So that should be at least somewhat useful. Oh, you're gonna make me go all the way under? Hello. You're going to poison me, and I'm going to beat you with a hammer. Sounds good. What is this? Chains and amber pearls. Hello. Take you out. So, I think we're looking for iron? Something like iron. Withered bone. I think I found one of those already. Let's see. What are we looking at here? That I did not mean to do. Dang it. All right. Bunch of sludge. Is that the end of it? Oh wait, muddy scrap pile. Oh, is this... Is this where I need a mine? What is this stuff? Uh, I think it's just a barrier. Muddy... Am I getting anything for this? I got leather. Why did I get leather? Um... Oh, iron scrapped. I got one iron scrapped out of all that. Here we go. Maybe this is the way out. 
or continuation. No, it doesn't look like it. Hum. That was a waste of time, I suppose. I do hear more splashing. Wait, what is this? Money scrap. Is there anything else I can mine? It doesn't appear so. Is there... Oh, here's we... here we go. This is what I'm looking for. An iron scrap. Two iron scraps. So the iron scraps, I believe, is what I need for the next upgrade tier. I also need to smelt it. What do we get in here? Slimes? Well, as long as it's only slimes, I think we're doing pretty good. Hello. I say that. Ow. There we go. And I'm out of stamina. Perfect. Alright, I think there's some more... Was this? Smud scrap. So I'm gonna try and see if I can't get any more scraps out of that. Doesn't appear so. Alright, what's in this chest here? What do we get? A withered bone... And I don't want that. Leave that. Uh, don't want the ooze. Anything else? There is more scrap right there. This is a open area. Lots of scrap, actually. How heavy is this? Oh, I'm not doing too bad right now. Grab as much of this as possible. It'd be nice to see, actually. Maybe I should buy that one thing from the merchant. That might be helpful. Here we go. Another room. Let's see what's in here. Looks like more slime. Might be a chest. Are there any chests in here? Any treasures untold? Oh, you're not a treasure untold. Lock you. Take you out. There's a lot of uh, scrap piles. That's actually pretty good, I guess, because that's going to give us quite a bit of iron. Most of that might mean that iron just requires a lot of iron to craft anything with. Which is going to be annoying. Of course, I could be wrong. I don't know yet. Another room. And um, we got another slime. Is there another draugr in here? I don't see a draugr. Though I do see much more uh, scrap piles. So a lot of scrap piles. I guess that's kind of what I want. Alright, well I'm just going to keep mining through this stuff until my pickaxe breaks or I find something interesting. I think I've found everything so far in this little crypt. Oh wait, no, it continues on. Oh, I guess I should keep my mouth shut. Anyway, here is biomass. And where are we? We're like way down here or up here. And he's way down here. So that's where the next boss is. Interesting. So there is a... Maybe there wasn't a point. I don't know. I'm thinking... Because I have this little base here. I don't think that base is very useful. It does attach to another mainland where it has the plains biome, though. So I might have to keep that for now. Anyway, we're going to continue on looking around this place. I think... How are we doing? Quite a bit of stuff. I did put some stuff away, but hopefully... We'll find some more iron, and then maybe I should do a transport, because my tools are nearly broken, too. So maybe I should start moving stuff back to the other base. Tools finally broken, so I think that means I'm going to have to start moving back. There was something out here. I don't remember where it is. It was like a big old pit with like a cage over the top. I want to see if I can't find that. It's like around here somewhere. Here it is. I want to see what this thing is. Because we found the biomass, and he's way down here, so I'm wondering... Because I thought this might be the biomass. Oh, you're a level through two, and you're a tree. How am I supposed to get down there? I don't know what to do at this point. Hello, tree. Should we fight the tree? We got a checkpoint. Like, I guess we can. Ow. Come on. There we go. There, yes. It helps if you're zoomed out. 
Let's go ahead and back off for a second. Yes. Suffer before me. Actually, let's go let's go ahead and use the mace actually. Or the axe. Is what I meant to say. Come on. There we go. This probably does like a micron more damage. All right, let's go ahead and have this thing. Ow. Oh dear. I oh, knocked a tree over. Fun, you ugly tree. There we go. Think you can defeat me? There. Blocking is really good in this. It's even fun, especially when you're fighting things like this. There we go. No more stupid tree stump. Give me your stuff. There we go, yummy. Uh, trophy collected. Abomination trophy. It's not, it's not much of a trophy. It's more like a wad of weeds. Hello. But you also like to die. Ow. Oh, I forgot some wood. Um, so there's that thing. I don't want to fight uh, the guy in there because he's like a level two and I, uh, I have tried to fight them before and it was really difficult. All right, so for now, I think I'm just going to be trying to move some of the stuff to my base over here. And then there's the boat. So I'm going to be putting the iron in the boat just so I can move it because you can't teleport uh, metals, which is annoying, but I guess it makes it more interesting. <sighs> Eat some food really quick, and this is the next dungeon, so hopefully we'll be able to get more iron, because that is what I need. So we're going to try and crack this one open. Is there any more crypts? Is that something? No, I think that's just some logs. Anything else out there? Anything else creeping? Doesn't appear so. Alright, we're going to crack this one open. There we go. Swamp key used. Into the sunken crypts we go. Same as last time. We got the little ledge there, but we are immediately greeted with a smutty pile. Let's go ahead and get rid of that really quick and move on. We get through here. Oh, we got a slime. Lovely. Have one of those before I get poisoned to death. Hello, where'd you go? There you are. Stupid. Um, okay. There's, here we go. Here's another muddy scrap pile. Dig through this one as well. What unholy critters do we have in here? I think I saw a slime. Yeah, there's a slime. Hello, slime. Hit you with my club. Or my club-based weapon, even though it's a maze. Oh, we got a ruby. That can stand there for now. Um, oh, there's another little piece right here. Grab you. Perfect. Down. I think we have to go down here. Another little swimming area. What do we got? Nope. What do we got? This is a dead end? Is this a really small one for some reason? That wouldn't make sense. I'm sure there's some sort of blob somewhere. Some sort of uh, mud pile. Where is it now is the question. Maybe this one is just a really small one. Huh. Oh, no. Here we go. There's two on the other side. I didn't even see these ones. Hello? Who is here? Oh, just another slime. Goodbye. Anyone else? I not see anyone else. What do we get here? Oh, chains and money. Take that. I'll take that for now. I'll probably put them in the other chest in the other room just so that I have an idea of where they are. Hello, ugly. There we go. I broke the lantern. Hello, blob. What are you gonna do? Coming to say hello? What's in here? More iron. That was quite a bit of iron, actually. And now we're encumbered. Uh, we're gonna leave that there. We're gonna go and put it in the other chest just so that I know where everything is. Uh, that was the wrong direction. Okay, let's see. Let's go this way, I think. This probably just leads back around. I think it loops, actually. I can't tell, so we're going to go ahead and check. What do we get? What's in here? What unholy abominations? 
Oh, it's just a big chest and an ugly uh, abomination. Are you level what? No, okay. You just have a purple eye. Why do you have a purple eye? Do you mind explaining that to me? What's with all the iron in the chests? There wasn't that many irons in the chest before. Anything else in here? This looks like a yeah, uh, nope. Right, how am I doing on carry weight? We're alright for now. Try to remember where I put all my iron just so that I can come back and get it. Probably move most of it, hopefully, to the other little swamp base, and then we can move it from there to the teleporter. Even though I can't teleport, I'm about to, to use the boat. Try and grab as much of the iron before I leave, though. Last room, hopefully. This one goes up. Which is interesting considering that that's the exit and this is another room. What do we get? Another mud pile? This one's interesting. I don't think I've seen it gone up before. At least it wasn't like that in the last one. Though, now that I look at it, that looks like it might be the end of this place. Anything? Does not appear to be so. Why is there water down there? That's interesting. Alrighty. That looks like it's everything for now. I'm going to try and move most of this resources. And then I'll catch up with you. So I think I have everything that I wanted. So I've got to be careful here because I want to only take stuff that I can't teleport. So let's see, what can I... I'm going to need to leave a lot of stuff. I also have like four, like four spaces, I think. Four points of storage on the boat. So that's going to be, that should be enough, I'm thinking. I'm also thinking, let's go ahead and clear out some of this junk. See, what can I teleport with? I can teleport with this junk. So I'm going to take all that. I also want the chains. Where are the chains? Here we go. Grab you. I think I'll leave the wood for now. Take those and you're going to put these over at the other base. So gonna store these, and then gonna head back, and hopefully gonna take the boat and move the iron over to this place. Because you cannot teleport with irons. I'm trying to think, I might want to at some point set up a furnace and like a crafting station, but that's also gonna require me to go through the Bronze Age again to make those little stations. So that might be a little bit annoying, but I don't think there's much I can do about it. Might be worth it, just so I can get the armor, though. Because it's only the... The metals that I can't teleport. As far as I know. Just need to grab the last bit of iron, and then we should be all set. I'm gonna take you guys out. Get over here. Hey! You can't leave. Alright, there we go. No more you, alright. Gonna go ahead and grab the last bit of iron, like I was saying, and then we'll be out of here. So let's go ahead and grab that. Where is it? Should be right there, only 12 pieces. We're gonna leave these, because I don't need those. And let's see, we're gonna go to the ship, and that will be everything. And there's more water to here, of course there is. All right, here we go. Into the boat we are, and then, no, put this stuff away. There we go, and now we're off. And we're going to set sail because we're off. Because that is the way that I'm going. Because words are difficult to say at this point in time. We got the wind behind us though. So we're going to have a quite a speedy trip hopefully. Though it's probably going to be difficult because everything is. I'm wondering could I like go through this way? Maybe I could like chop up some of the terrain so I could go through here. Because it's already got the whole pond. And that lead us right to there. And that's like a quick little route right there. That'll make things much easier. Might have to do that when I get get around there. Alright. I think this is what I was looking for. Is that... Is it? Please? Is it a river? That's what I want to know. Is this way a river? Because if it is, it's probably going to lead into this river, which will give me, like, cut this whole area out. So that would be really useful. It looks like a river. Oh, I'm going to go through it for now. Hopefully I don't take too much damage. Probably going to have to get my pickaxe ready just in case. It does look like a river. I was kind of afraid it might be a uh, little inlet or something weird. Alrighty, though, that's nice. Have to be careful, though. Well, I think I found the lake at least. So that's this area. We traveled through there, so now we got to go upward. 
and hopefully find uh, my base, which it's right there, so it shouldn't be too difficult. I'm just curious to know if I go out here far enough, will it be classified as Black Forest or Ocean? Where does that place lead? I need to figure out where this leads to, though it doesn't look like there's any rivers that lead out. Well, it seems to be just classified as Black Forest anyway, so I'm just going to keep going. And here we are, back home. Now I just got figure out how to park the boat with the annoying waves right now. And my pier seems to be completely almost covered in water, so that might be interesting to park at. Let's go ahead and see if I can't do this. Oh, do a little closer maybe. Go backwards, go back. Let's go ahead and straighten up. There we go, that is not helping. All right, um, the Right, that thing's there. Hey! No! Go away! Little bugger. Alright, let's go ahead and see. Can I do repairs? Can I... There we go. Missing requirement. It's not missing, you just don't want to use it. Get a little bit, little bit closer. Just a little bit. Come on. Is that close enough? No. There we go. Perfect. Alright, let's go ahead and grab you and then jump off the boat before it uh breaks oh there's a bunch of waves now you're not letting me get out i think the lower steps might have broke maybe no they're still good all right let's go ahead and stick this iron within the smelter and then hopefully we can discover some new goodies See, we're going to need some coal, so I'm going to go ahead and grab that coal. That should be like 50 coal. That probably didn't pick any of it up because I am full. Iron scraps added. Grab as much as this stuff as I can. Go ahead and start cooking. So there we go. That's going to take a while. In the meantime, I'm going to try and unload the rest of the boat. So that should be fun. Let's see. Let's see what new items we can craft. Iron, iron scale mail, iron greaves, and a bunch of other iron stuff. What's that? Battle axe. Ooh, a battle axe. Helmet, nails, mace, shield, iron buckler, ancient something or other. Horn of celebration, and a bunch of other doodads. That's a lot. Uh, iron gate. That looks cool. I yeah, put some stuff in. Iron gate, more iron gates. I think I, that was a bigger chest. Other colored uh, lanterns. Is that it? Apparently that's it. Bigger chest. Uh, reinforced chest. Interesting. What else do we get here? A bunch of other colored lanterns. More building materials. Oh, all you need is iron to make the iron gate. That's cool. I want masonry. That's kind of the thing I want. Let's see. I did find this thing. Bellows. Uh, we need chains, wood, and deer hide. I have the chains. I think the chains are over here, actually. Chains! Where are you? Right there. And now we need the this stuff, and then we should have plenty of wood. Grab the wood. Where is it? There we go. Got plenty of that. There we go. Bellows. What does this do? Bellow forge upgrade. We need to put it near the forge, I believe. Does it have to be on terrain, maybe? Would that work? No. It's got to be near this thing, I think. Oh, it's got to be right next to this thing. There we go. Level 4. Level 4 forge. Can we make iron nails? Iron that stuff. I mean, we need 20. Ouch, we need 20. I did get quite a bit of iron, though, so I'm going to go ahead and cook as much of that as I can. Okay, so I have quite a bit of iron at the moment. I still need to smelt quite a bit of it, but for the moment, I want to see what iron nails are going to give me. So let's go ahead and make some of those. Iron nails, what is that? Raven throw? Oh, there's a new boat. Let's go ahead and see what the new boat requires. Uh, needs bronze. Why does it need bronze? No, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Long ship. 100 nails, deer hide, fine wood, ancient bark. Huh. That might be a little bit difficult to make. Let's see. Because I didn't know you needed the ancient wood. I thought the ancient wood was just an annoying thing that you could get from the trees. But oh well, you actually need it. 
You also need it for a lot of the other outfits, or the new armor, or the wood, and the weapons, so... I have to start gathering that up, too, so that's gonna be a on-to-do project. Probably gonna hopefully make the big bow, actually. Right now, as soon as I get enough of the firm wood, I'm probably gonna go and try and gather up some of that stuff. Okay, all we need is ten hide. Let's grab, grab ten. No, grab ten. Grab 10, there we go, and then something else. I think we need 40 wood and I burnt my fish, that's stupid. Um, yes, 40 of this. Give me 40, exactly. There we go. 40 of that, so now we should be able to make the longboat, so let's go ahead and do that. What are we missing? We're missing the workbench, so that's all we need. Go over here and try not to get stuck on things. See how this looks. Uh, it sure is a long boat. I'm not sure if I can get all the way in the water. If I could get into the little pier here. But you fit! Eh. Whoa. My word, that's big. What are these? They're spots to sit on. Well, this might be difficult to control. I'm not, is this like the final tier ship? It might be. It's a big boat, wow. Can I build on this boat? That's why I really want to know if you can build on these. I don't think so. I don't have enough materials to build anything. Oh, well. Well, that's nice. Now I'm just going to make some armor, and then we'll be more or less set. I also know we'll probably want to make the pickaxe, and then some other tools, just so I can go and grind some more iron, just in case. There's also one other thing I want to see if I can't make. I think I only need eight of those. Then I also need 30 abyssal barnacles. Where are they? I found them. I just get them because I, they're rare to find them, so I grab them when I can, the barnacles. Let's see, uh... Three leather. We need three leather. Let's go ahead and grab that then. Here they are! Let's grab exactly three, please. There we go. Three of that. That should give me... The thing I want. There we go. Abyssal Harpoon. And you get those from, like, the big floating islands that disappear sometimes. So here we go. Harpoon. So I think I can throw it. Oh, it just has infinite throws. So I think this is mainly for, like, using against the... What's it called? What are they called? Uh, the Sea Serpents. I think this is mainly just for fighting against those, because it has infinite usage, apparently. Let's go ahead and... Can I upgrade it? It does not appear to be an upgradable item, which is interesting, but oh well. It's nice to have it. It's a cool harpoon, and plus it has infinite uses. From infinite range, almost. I don't know why it's infinite range. It doesn't have infinite range. It's just nice to have. So we're gonna go ahead and hold on to that. Just in case, I'm probably going to store it on the ship in case I ever go fishing for sea serpents. Let's see, what else do we need? I think we just need the... What do we need? Just need iron. Need iron. What do I want to make, though? I think I might just go ahead and make the buckler and the mace again. And then later on, depending on what enemies I encounter, I'll look up their weaknesses. So yeah, let's go ahead and make armor for now. Let's go ahead and put some of my junk away also. Okay, so we're going to need leather. Let's go ahead and grab the deer hide, not leather. Then we're going to also need this stuff. Grab a lot of it, because we're going to need a lot of it. So I think I'm going to make the full set, hopefully. It's probably going to be quite a bit. It's only three pieces, so it's going to be like, what, 30? No, it's going to be over 30. Oh, forgot each piece is 20. Uh, we might as well go ahead and make the shirt and the pants for now. Make that, and then the pants. Can I make the helmet? No, I cannot. Let's go ahead and just put these on, though. There we go. There we go. Well, I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with, like, my leftover pieces of clothing. Can I just, like, throw it? Or will that be, like, bad? Anyway, I'm just going to store them in here. I should probably figure out how to get rid of those. I don't know if I can sell them or not. See how my guy looks. He looks pretty good now. Looking kind of cool. All right, let's see. 
have 30 more of that. I think we're almost out, so I might want to go ahead and just make the pickaxe really quick so that I have that. What does the pickaxe require? Probably requires the, the this stuff. What is it called? The wood. Might have to go grab some more wood also. Let's go ahead and check. What does it need? Where is it? Iron pick. It requires three core wood. I also want to make this bow. Where'd the bow go? The bow required... No, the battle axe was 35. I want to make the bow and the pickaxe. Well, I should probably make the pickaxe first. So let's go ahead and do that. While I am encumbered, let's go ahead and grab core wood. Make this pickaxe. Here we go. Pickaxe. New pickaxe. There we go. Pickaxe. Bronze, or the iron buckler. Uh, I probably should have made the helmet too. Um, oh well. Let's see. Let's go ahead and get rid of some of that. Forgot where I put the other stuff all of a sudden. So, bronze pickaxe. We don't need you anymore. I'm going to put you in here too. But we do have this pickaxe. Did I make the... I did make the bronze... Or the iron buckler. Let's go ahead and get rid of the bronze buckler now. Let's see. Can I make the helmet yet? My guy looks pretty good without a helmet though. He looks cool. Uh, let's see. Helmet. Where is the helmet? Iron helmet. We need 20. We literally need one more piece and then we could. But I probably want to make the mace. The mace might be a better choice just so I can kill the enemies quicker. That just needs uh, normal wood, 20 of that, and a bunch of bunch of leather. Got the leather now. Let's see. Can I grab this? Yeah, so I can grab you. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, uh, what is it? Iron mace. We need the wood. Let's grab four pieces of wood. So that's not four pieces. We just need the four. There we go. And that's going to be all of the iron. Hopefully that'll give us access to be able to get more iron. So we're going ahead and make that. There we go. Iron mace. So that's going to be good against the undead critters. Um, I'm probably going to have to stick to the this helmet for now. The bronze one. Well, I think that's going to be the end of this episode. I'm going to do a bit more grinding and try and get more iron to make a full set of iron tools. But until then, I'm probably just going to be doing that. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, I hope you had a good time. So I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.